Hello, everybody. <laughs> Shut up. How okay. do I do it? I, I have to go in my higher range, but then it's like, I feel like I'm going through puberty again. Because like the voice is going up and down. And I, Are you like breaking and cracking? A little bit. You know, because well, I'm you, trying to find the range, and it feels like I have a piece of God knows what in my throat. Because if I go down like this, like I know my tongue is very long. But you practiced, and you were like, <clears throat> "Hello, everybody. This is <laughs> what did you do? I just <clears throat> I have to I have to like <clears throat> wait. I have to go into my female voice, and it still sounds. Very... Hold on, I'm gonna go get the keyboard <laughs> turned on, and I'll hit the key. No, stop. I think if you hit the A. On the keyboard up from middle C. I just gotta work. That's on where that. you wanna be. So I'll be right no, back. No, no, stop. It's it's but see, it still feels like I have something. Doesn't it sound like I have something stuck? Something's in your throat, like yeah, a frog. Like a frog. <laughs> never mind. Anyway, I never thought I saw the day that I had to take my name change. But wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Gotta well, tell everybody about uh, the new you. Yes, the new. <laughs> Yes. Cause what, I, what, what precipitated this? Because I have to step it up the next level. I was like wanting to do this, but then I'm freaking out that <clears throat> the people that know me are going to like go, what? No, you're you know? freaking out that. You're freaking out that I was going to freak out. Yes, that too. But you're one of the people that knows me. <laughs> so you were freaking out that I didn't like want you to do this or something? Something, yeah. Because it was like I was trying to take it gradual. That's not true. No. No. I wanted you to do this a long time ago. But, you know, you kind of went half ass on me. <laughs> I know. Why not just, if you're going to go in, might as well just go in. Because I was trying to do, like, gradually baby steps, and then I wore that ugly half wig thing that you Okay, hated. well, that thing was not a wig. I know. It was a it's, it's a clip-in hairpiece. I know. I was trying to start it. Halfway. It was like, why are you wearing that? But I didn't want to say anything because I felt bad for you. I was like, gosh. I mean, I, and it's not like, okay, a tranny is not supposed to tell a genetic woman how to dress. Right. That's but, what, uh, that's but, what but you weren't, are saying. But you weren't caring. No, because I hadn't cared in 13 years. I mean, I was well, just coasting, and so... But you need to care. I do. I do care, but I just and don't I was just like, about it. You need to wear... Like a hair piece that like actually looks nice. Yeah. This one actually looks nice. On and now me. I gotta lose weight because I'm being fat. Oh my god! How many times are you gonna have to hear this? You're like, we have to change. We have to change our diet. <laughs> it's like, okay, we eat fish. No, you know we eat chips. seafood. A lot of chips. Lately, we've been having yeah. some chips. But it's not like all and then bad. cookies and. Okay, but we're in a stage of transition. Yes, we are. You're detransitioning, <laughs> and we're transitioning from living in New Mexico okay. to moving to Florida. Yes, so, and it's cold. Yeah, so it's cold. Yes. So you need to, you need to have comfort food. Yes. But I feel so huge. You're not, though. Remember, I come from an, an a bulimic anorexic You're eating not disorder huge. stuff, so i got to work on that. You know, today I saw there was... People at the restaurant today, mm -hmm. they're huge. Yeah. No, they're, they're enormous. You are not huge. Okay. You're like a petite. I mean, you would say that you were five foot five, and I come find out you're five foot four. <laughs> so now it's like you don't say you're five foot five. Now you're five foot four. Yeah, I'm five foot four. Oh, how sweet. So, okay, so today we went to. Um, our restaurant, the place that we go and do, like, <laughs> birthdays, anniversaries, um, everything, everything. Because there's already no other restaurant. And that our engagement, our yeah. engagement, our wedding, yeah, our wedding. Yep. And you know they don't really have good food there. No. Really, it's not all really fried, good food. fried stuff and yeah. bad stuff. But today was a special day because I got to meet a person. Who I had been wanting to meet for a very long time and this person is very special because they actually helped rescue me from the top of the mountain when I fell like a couple a couple of years ago. What did I do to myself? I don't know. Boo -boo. What did you do? I don't know. 
Did you bite it? No, I didn't bite Do it. Do I have to watch out for you now? Well, I know what it is. I want to get something out of my bag and I cut myself. Mm. I have the razor in there. That's not good. So you already got like a boo-boo on this side. I know, and then I got another okay. boo-boo from the razor. So anyway, we were visiting with this friend and it was all, you know, deciding what you wanted to wear, you know, because you wanted to, you know, go. I didn't know if I was going to know what you were going to do. Yeah, because I haven't been, I've been going out pretty much like in a neutral mode. So you've been cross-dressing? <laughs> Shut up. How does a woman cross-dress anyway? It's like, this is what Maritza is, a woman. Yeah. So this isn't cross-dressing, this is redressing. Redressing. Retransitioning, redressing. Re yeah. But I mean, I think there were times when you just like I would show you like my wig collection because I have a huge wig collection, mm -hmm. and you would just be like, um, I just don't like wigs on my head. Mm -hmm. They just feel like blah blah blah, blah. Mm -hmm. and it's like, okay, she's not ready. For that. Mm -hmm. But today, what did you do? I was ready. I tried a whole bunch of them, and this one was one of the ones that I liked. And so, what happened when you got ready and you wanted to show me and stuff? How did you feel? I didn't want to be judged. Judged? Judged. Here's an MTF and you're gonna, mm -hmm. you think I'm going to judge a woman mm -hmm. on her appearance? Mm -hmm. I just didn't want you to wear that mop. <laughs> I mean, seriously, it's like a mop. <laughs> On top of her head with like a with like a <laughs> headband. Like, and I'm like, if she moves her head any which way, she's gonna it's gonna fall off and it's gonna be Oh, it worked for the show. Yeah, I know. And I gotta buy more clothes. I don't have female clothes, I don't make clothes and well shopping is not yeah. a bad thing, is it? No. So there's all those cheap clothing stores that yeah. we went to in Florida. Mm -hmm. So be fine. you're in business. Yeah. What? Shopping? <laughs> Is that right? Something I haven't done the whole time we've been in New Mexico. So, I'm ready for some shopping with my girl. Mm -hmm. So, it'll be awesome. Anyway, the story I was going to talk about, my oh. license, of course, reads Mark, Angela Cummings, and still mail. So I'm like, if I get carded, for booze, which I did, I knew it was gonna happen, so I'm like, oh my god, I'll say what do I have to do. So I brought along and that's where the blood Is that from your Yeah, that's from my cut. I'm like, why mm -hmm. is that bleeding? So I had to bring along my name change from my yeah, name. Well, I don't want to well, yeah. No 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 my name's uh, Cummings to Mark Angel Cummings. I was like, Well that's what the license says and this is who I am. That's why I'm dressed like this. So the waiter was like uh, okay, <laughs> I've seen enough, yeah. you know, because you showed... And then I had to show my citizen paper, which right. says Maritza Cummings, my date of birth. So this is becoming is my Is this your green ID. card? No, this is my citizenship <laughs> paper, not green card. She's legal. The United States of America Certificate of Naturalization. So you can't be president? No, because I'm naturalized. Bummer. I can. Well. <laughs> and... Anyway, so this is becoming my new ID till I get to Florida, and then in Florida, I will have to have everything straight now, and the M change back to an F, and all that good stuff. So how does it feel? It feels great. It yeah. really does. Yeah? It really does. I was not ready for this, um, and I kind of explained stuff in my blog, for those that have been reading my blog, but I think... I've always been too spirited, because I love my masculine side, too. I could dig that side as well. But I think when I was experimenting and trying to, you know, yeah. do my thing, my mom really pushed me away from the masculine side and tried, kept shoving all the feminine stuff on me. And I used to like, you know, playing around with the feminine stuff, but when it became like it, it was a have to, it was almost like I went the opposite direction. But you were like girlfriends with, you know, what was it, with Arlene? Mm -hmm. And weren't you the... I was feminine. I was the... You the were woman. feminine. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, but then I started messing with steroids, and that kind of. So you went a little crazy. No, not crazy, but it makes you. Like, it messes with your mind, and it makes you more masculine, and then you kind of like. 
I just kind of lost all my, I, it made me feel very masculine. It made me feel, and it's happened to other female bodybuilders. So you didn't want to be feminine anymore no, and at I, that point? Yeah, and then when I heard about the trans thing, when I went to Key West, it was like, oh, that's me. But it wasn't no, you. No, it wasn't me. That was you for 13 years. Though. 13 years. <laughs> Had enough. No more. So you played that game. You yeah. got the card. You got the t-shirt. To prove it. Yeah. Now I got the facial hair, I got the laser, I got the, everything that I have done. I can regrow oh, hair. What's, what's this? Where did these come from? <laughs> Pat and Braun. I mean, are you like a chameleon or what? I am, aren't I? I mean, I, there's people commenting on your picture and it's like... Yeah. Oh my god, Maranza? Yeah. How'd you do it? <laughs> <laughs> So you are a witch, is that what it is? <laughs> Pretty much. So, what does this mean for the future for you? What future? Future with like you with, with with you as far as as far as how you how you present and everything. Well, as I said, I'm, once I get all my paperwork, well, not that I have these two papers. I don't. Are we gonna travel with Marenzo? Yes. I mean, you're maybe not. No matter what. Maybe not all the get up or whatever, but yeah, more and more. And more. I mean, right. I want to be able to just, you know, be myself full time, and I sound like I'm an empty <laughs> man. I swear, I feel like I'm full yeah. time. I now totally respect all my transgender <laughs> sisters completely. So you're thinking about going full time? Let's full time. <laughs> so you're only cross dressing on the part time. Right now, I'm cross dressing as Mark part time, <laughs> and I'm going to be married to full time. Oh my god! But you know, once I get more get up and acclimated, acclimated and get my paperwork in, in, you know, but yeah. But okay, but how did it feel? Like okay, you're talking to a former cross dresser. <laughs> how does it feel going out into the, into the? Like, like, it felt great. It felt normal. I mean, this is what I've been f for the first 37 years. So you're not a No, I'm a woman. I'm a woman. Wait, are you distracted by your phone? No, my phone. <laughs> so what's your phone? It's like if there's like a little beep or a buzz or anything, you like have to go, is that for me? It's like someone liked to come in. <laughs> so, oh, and I can't wait to grow my own hair. It's wigs, you know, I'm sure I'll have to get used to them. I mean, it's like, it's it's the lesser of two evils. The, the bald, ugly head <laughs> with gray hair that I can't stand. What are you guy. supposed to do? I mean... You can't sleep with like this, that? though. Yeah, but you don't have to show that. You don't have to sleep with that mm. with me. Mm. Everything will fall off and mm. stuff. <laughs> so, I mean, I don't think that, you know... It's as bad as you, as you thought. No, it's not. Actually, I actually enjoyed going out. There was no weird looks or anything like that. I was like waiting for all that, but actually pulled it off pretty well. Well, look at you. I mean, <laughs> it is, you know, it's different because now it's like, now we're like, you know, and uh, people are going to be offended. Or I'll whatever. let them get offended, whatever. We're lesbians. You know, we're lesbians. <laughs> so like it or not like it, that's what we are. That's what that's what we're going to be presenting as. Yeah. And I, I found myself hesitant to hold your hand in the parking lot. You know, I know. I was like, wait a minute, things change here. <laughs> we're in Silver City. <laughs> we're in Silver City. We're going to get shot. I mean, with them two women doing all the men hands. So. I think it's appropriately good that we're going to Florida. Yeah, because then it doesn't matter. Because my know, sister and lover hold hands and everybody, yeah. you know. So, I mean, yeah. But I did, I thought. Me too. Even in the restaurant, it was a couple times. And what's his face kind of went, what are they doing? <laughs> <laughs> and I'm like, oh, wait a minute. Okay, yeah, wait yeah. But no, it, Silver's gay marriage is legal in it, it everywhere. Is. And even before it was everywhere, it was legal here in New Mexico. It is, and it shouldn't be an issue. Yeah. We just, just be just, ourselves. Well, yeah, I know, but you know, I, I found myself being hesitant for some reason. We're married. Well, yeah, we're married. It no matter, doesn't matter. 
no matter what, you know, mm -hmm. we're married. But I just, I just wanted to... I did too, in the restaurant. Because I went to hold your hand and I was like... <clears throat> <laughs> I went to hold your hand <laughs> on the way inside the restaurant yeah. and I was like, um, hmm. But I think, you know what, I think they might go, oh, that's the same couple. Whoa. He looks a little different tonight, you know, and then probably would have known or whatever. They're eccentric. Yes, they are. <laughs> they switch roles. I didn't switch any roles. No, I do. That's why like, I stayed. I you know, I thought the switch your me, yeah. But, you know, you're the true chameleon in the family. Yes. I've gotten some really, really nice comments, and one of the comments from a friend of mine, which I think it, it's, um, I don't know if I can find it. Is it yeah, better if you blow on your phone? <laughs> there was Does it go there. faster? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Did you see, see that? It? Yeah, it's told funny. you. It, it, goes it must be air around. pressurized. <laughs> yeah, it's something like that. But, oh, hearts, oh, he keeps sending me hearts. He's in love with you, tell him you're taking it. Yeah, he knows what it's like, I love you, but it's up. <laughs> I love you. Now I'm going to have to worry about you no. in Florida. He goes, you're such a trip. I'm not sure you venture into virtual re uh, worlds, but you're a champion really in this one. Um, I've experienced a fluid fluidity virtually, but not like you in the flesh. You are a patron saint. Wow. Um, a saint? Yes. Peace is one of your major attributes and love, of course. The bond that unites us. Bravo. The kudos... And kudos to Mark, the man behind the woman. What are you doing? They're seeing There's, rings. There's tissue left on her. <laughs> They're growing. He hasn't haven't had any estrogen yet. But, you know, this is all non-estrogen at all. And they are seeing the wigs and lipstick. That's not Where it. Going? Hmm? But those props will help them see your true message. Congratulations, honey. Um, I'm happy for you. It will take hundreds of years for them to get it. I oh. consider myself lucky to be oh. able to have met you. I value that you... I value that and you, and really thanks. Just the struggles, I sympathize. Empathy is my goal. Through you, through your teachings, I feel it. I'm happy your resolves to seems to be love. Oh, yeah. You're such a beautiful embodiment of a human condition. I have to say I love you. I do. That was very sweet. Extremely sweet. Except for the I love you part. And all these little like hearts. I don't like the I love you part. <laughs> Loves me as a person. I'm not, okay. Okay. not that other. But yes, that was very sweet. That's really sweet. <clears throat> so yeah, so this is uh I belong to you, you belong to me. This is um you know this is the path. This is the path going on. Very much so. And I'm so glad that you're, you know, finally feeling more comfortable to take it, you know, and it's not, you're a woman, you know, you're a woman without a wig, you're a woman oh, yeah. with a wig, it doesn't matter, it's just, you know, it's just how you feel comfortable presenting yourself, you know. Well, I think as my face and everything changes, and as my hair grows, and and, and, your boobs I, and my boob goes, and, and I, I do it. One can't. boob is going to happen? <laughs> Two boobs. You said one <laughs> boob girls. Boobs. But I'm looking forward to it. I'm really looking forward to my evolution, my uh, returning to me. And this time around, wanting it to be me. You know, like before, it, it just seemed strange to be Maritza, and it's just like this masculine energy would come. And... Not that the masculine energy is going to go away completely, because I think I'm very much in tune with both of my sides. But I'm, I'm going to create something very, very, very good. Yeah, I think that your detransitioning is going to let you finally, like, accept Maritza. Yes. You know, because, I mean, for so many years, you put her on the shelf and you put her away and... You know, you stuffed her, you know, and it's so nice to finally be able to appreciate the beautiful woman that you are. Definitely. And to be able to share with you on this journey in your life is really a privilege for me to be able to do that. And I'm so grateful. 
that we get to I'm grateful to have you in my life and that you actually brought this upon me. Well, I'm sorry if I came across as as feeling making you feel bad about yourself or anything because that wasn't that wasn't the reason. I just didn't, you know. I don't know. I just wanted you to embrace yourself, you know. And when you weren't doing that, I just felt like you were selling yourself short. Because you're a beautiful woman, and you have and just an energy to you and an ability to just turn it on that, you know, just be you and enjoy it, you know. Instead of like going, oh, should I wear this? <laughs> should I put this on? Or, oh, and it's like, you know, now I just feel like you're more yeah. comfortable. It's kind of a new, a, 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 another step. Yeah. You know, and you're like, oh, it's been such a long time since I've done makeup, and mm. I'm a little rusty, <laughs> and it's like, I don't think she did bad with her makeup. I think she's just fine. Mm. You weren't rusty at all. Mm -hmm. You're like an artiste. Mm. So, anyway, we're gonna get to watching more L Word. Yes, we are. Enjoy that. So let me Great give show. it a little close up. Oh, you're showing your cleavage? Is that There's my you? cleavage. <laughs> <laughs> if I think I'm crazy. <laughs> you are crazy. That's beyond... Crazy in love with you. That's beyond the point. Mm, yes. That's not my lipstick. <laughs> <laughs> now we have to worry about... I know, it's like this lipstick. Up. It's like, oh my gosh. Does that mean for lipstick <laughs> lesbians? <laughs> <laughs> lipstick lesbians... Mm. Yeah. Okay. Mm. I I can see radical feminists oh, right have, now. They're gonna have cringing. Like, roll the eyes oh and all that they're stuff. Gonna, like, yeah. I don't know what else they're gonna write. Life is too short to live in such anguish, fear, and hate. And a little head nod. Yes. <laughs> There's a little. <laughs> women do it too. Women do the head nod. Yes, we do. He's maybe not rad fans because they're really fighting their woman stuff. Embrace it. It feels good. <laughs> Trust me. Just, just stop fighting. Stop hating and love. Love is the most important and wonderful thing in the world. So, we're going to go get changed, get comfy. <laughs> Aren't you going to go to bed like this? No. <laughs> You're not? Unless you want me to. I've got a 90 for you. Okay, I'll wear that. I'll wear the 90. <laughs> but you said you weren't going to wear your hair. I'll keep the hair, but then you're supposed to sleep with hair. Yeah, I, don't yeah. I think we've rambled long enough. Yes, I think so. We're probably driving them crazy. All right, guys. We love you. But remember, remember to, to love, love yourselves, yourself. too. Bye-bye.